off to christen this game. You said 12? Okay. From back of the end zone, he'll bring it out. I imagine he's going to get an earful on the side. The offense set for a first down play. Relax, dude. Yeah, hurry up. From the gun, he leaves it with the back. Maybe picked up a couple as he gets it to the 14. Oh man, there's some big hitting going on in the trenches right now. This defense, they take a lot of pride in stopping the run. Let's keep our eye on them throughout the course of the game and see if they can contain this run. food that's already on the, on the counter. After picking up a couple, it's second and eight. Toss sweep. Try to get it outside to the right. Across the 25, he's got room. He's run out of bounds, but a big play on that one, and it'll be a first down. Nebraska's had a lot of guys to feed over the years. Mike Rozier, Roger Craig, I am hip. But you don't know who's going to get it with this running attack. Yeah, but I do know this, Reese. Whoever gets it is going to run the football physically. And Nebraska's going to be very happy. Their fan base will be jacked if they establish the physical ground game because that's who they are. There you go. Squirts across the 30 to the 32-way pickup of five. It's going to be important this offensive line is able to get a little bit of push. Just kind of give this guy an inch, a little crease, and he can make yards for it. Okay. Halfway there on first down, it's second and five. Looking to pass, it's Rayola. Takes the easy one to the back. Oh, He's there to make the stop, and they threw it in reverse, losing yardage on that play. Man, there are certain guys that I want to make sure I hone in on, and I do not give them the football in space. And this running back is one of those guys. Really good job by the defense, keeping their eyes on their keys and not letting him sneak out and get any kind of space. As soon as he touched it, he was on the ground. On third and long, he has to throw for it. He wants to go deep. Yes, sir. He's oh. going down the left. Let's go. Oh, go. Oh, the tap. Touchdown. I told Buster. you it's one. Hey, I'm telling you. He got I, I like this playbook. Let's fucking go. And tight ends do so much for your offense. Ooh. They block like crazy. You pull them. You use them. They look like my home. It's just the cherry on top of the sun. Yeah. Making big I'll put it be right in front of him. Half the field plus I to get the big him. touchdown. And the Let's extra point makes it 7 0. A very efficient five play scoring drive. And the points come in a lightning strike. A 70 yard touchdown pass. Yeah, yeah, boy. You know, get better for y'all leave. That's all I'm doing. I need him. Let's see what he can get done from inside his own 15. Needed just a little more. They can see my play all day long. Return him on the chest out here. 10 bit, line got blown up on that play. There was nowhere for that guy to go. Tad bit. Not what they had in mind to start this drive. Here comes second and 13. From the gun, the ground uh -oh. game. We sitting on that. Down, he's going to lose a yard on that one. That back had nowhere to go. Defensive yeah. line ate up the block. Half of the line. And the running game has been disastrous on the last couple of plays. They'll try to salvage the drive on third down. Gonna take a shot. Pick up. And try to get that, that well, Madden, that's a pick. Madden, that's a pick. I'll take the Madden, that's a pick. Standing outstanding job here on the deep pass. Locating like. the football. <laughs> Locate the rod, dude. Able to swat it away past the Aggies send out the punt team to kick it away. 
They'll have to punt for the first time this afternoon. Hey. Oh, speed! Put a stop to that return right at the 30-yard line. about that quarterback. You oh, I got to put that in. That's me. That's a bad player. That's a great job good. taking apart the defense, Jess. I got on that last that up. He really did, man. I mean, that was a master class in just reading coverage. I ain't gonna lie, ball. Well, I stumbled upon them. Uh, Halfway the there on first down and second playing. and five. Hey, this shit kind of nuts. They'll try to get the edge with the toss play here. Block is That's going. what you expect from a senior. Don't give them any extra yards. Great this tackle there. Blocked. And those physical runs take a toll. It might not be a big hey, game now, win. but down the Look road, at it, look. I got three blockers right in the all way inside. They can touch each other. They didn't do anything. They plow ahead with the run, but still more ground needed to pick up the first down. Third down coming. Looking to throw for it. And he can't escape, and down he goes. Is Mike back or showing some versatility? Think he always just has to stay home and play the run? Was bringing the pass rush that time. No, nah, this ain't old school oh. football anymore, Reese. These guys got to be I thought to so my running back to stay in block. <laughs> and run games All he had to do was stay in block. They can do besides from making the calls and being the communicator on hey, defense. These guys are as personal as it gets. Nobody yeah, that's all. Like, what the Fourth hell? down, and the punt team sends it the other way. Bringing it back, it's Barber. And they're able to put a stop to that return right at the 30-yard line. Texas A&M has it back, and we say howdy to the Aggie offense again. The last time we saw this offense, we had to look oh, yeah, man. three and out, Jesse. We just had no rhythm in that last drive. So someone's going to have to make a play, David, and get this thing going. Yeah, let's find some you. juice. Find your guy. Find those plays yeah, that you know just can run well. inside out, a game. backwards. Get some first downs. Get some positive momentum. Back to pass. It's Wegman. Got his Ooh, man in the middle. Kitch. They make the stop, and that's how the first quarter will end. A third down play to get the quarter started. From the gun, wants to pass. Now moving to his right, looking for anyone that's open. He dropped it. And that's oh. incomplete. A defender all over him. Knocked the ball to the ground. Fourth down coming up. That's tough. This is a point. Hey, I dropped one like that earlier. Huh? Like critical down Cutting distances off. in this game. Like that third down right there. When it's a good throw, you've got to make the catch. You've got to be able to make that play. What you think, Chad? Oh, yeah. I don't know if this is the time for this type of risk. Offense going for it inside its own 40. On fourth down, going to the air. Got you. And they get to it. And so slamming them. Back and they'll stop the drive on down. And I tell you what, I can justify when it's really short. When it's fourth and medium on your side of the territory, Man, that success rate continues to plummet. <laughs> oh, you, oh, you must have just you tapped me too fast. You did the ball face. Yeah, 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 you tapped it too fast. If you double tap it too fast, uh, it'll be a ball fake instead of throwing it. Cornhuskers ready to go back to work on offense. They had to punt it away on their last possession, but man, what great field position oh, yeah. this time. I mean, this is awesome. Oh, yeah. Last possession didn't go great. Now you're set up in an opportunity to get some points, to start thinking about what plays I like, Jesse, as I cross the field. There are a lot of offensive coordinators out there, David, and in this position, oh, they yeah, like Ryan. to take a shot right away and try no! to capitalize on this field. You what? Drop shot plays all the time. Oh my God. Coordinators love to take deep shots down the field. They plan them. They plan when they're going to do This game is horrible. And I bet you will plan to see a few more throughout this game. This game is horrible. Oh my God.
This game is so horrible. Oh my, come on, Mahone Junior. You make those. They went up top on second and this short. game Surely is they stick horrible. To the ground here on third I swear, and bro. Looking for a man. It's Rayola. Got his man quickly. Makes the grab, and it's enough Damn, for the first bro. down before he's dragged to the ground. The Cornhuskers want to crank the tempo. Well, they caught the defense off guard with that play. Right? Like. Here they are in field goal range, third and short. You know, the odds say it's going to be a run. Instead, they throw it. They get a big play now setting up first and goal. Grabbed in the back. Hold it real quick. Well, let me get some under. Quarterback will audible. The aerial assault continues. Let's go to the end zone. There we go, man. The same Very fucking throw. The same throw I'm trying there. to make. Let's go. This shit open. Man, it's not an accident. They're I'm telling you, boss. I found some. That's your job as a I swear, boy. Look at that. Look at that. Ooh. Ooh. Ah, the, the, the first. I wanted the first one because that one was even better, but this, for some reason, you just made him miss it. And the extra point pushes the lead to 14. A very efficient five play scoring. Let's drive. go, man. And they finish up, it off by connecting from 10 yards out. About to kick it off. Hey, I did, um, I did a I did a kick like this earlier, and Geek didn't field it, and it bounced all the way to the one yard line. When he He'll touched it, his man went the uh, his man went into the end zone and I tackled him for a safety. <laughs> I was like, oh yeah, this is over with. Texas AM has it back in the offense, ready to go to work. They've stumbled a little bit out of the gate here, Jesse, finding themselves down by two scores. Oh, yeah, yeah. The defense needs to help them out and get off the field and get them some more possessions. This offense didn't spend a lot of time on the field in the first quarter, David. I think they got to run the ball here and try to establish some rhythm. they got to establish something, and you're right. You'll wear your defense out continue. You keep getting the football back to them, to the other offense, you're wearing your defense out, and you'll have no shot to get back in this game. Can anyone catch him? They got him free for a big gainer down to the 43. I'll tell you, the defense is going to have to do a much better job containing these outside run plays. They better be able to funnel the football back to the middle of the field because this guy with his speed can kill you like he did on that outside run play there to the left. Finally, this offense starting to shake the cobwebs and get things moving. Let's step over. Man, no word to run on that. <laughs> About all you can say is do better. But that's the problem. Are they able to do better? And that's why you keep trying things, right? Keep trying to get on the perimeter, run up the middle, try different things. Pick! What, you do. what are you? And that's going to be incomplete. A lot of contact on the play, but no there flag is. for the third down. Now, did you see hey, man, if you're going to force incompletions when the QB's throwing the tight end, you better be physical. Nice job with the hit, forcing that incompletion. Here comes this home crowd as the defense tries to get off the field on third down. He's right oh, on target. Oh, uh, talk it up. They'll talk finally about it. get him on the ground, but not before he makes him to the 30 and gets a first down. That was a nice mm -hmm. pickup running the drag route and finding oh, that quiet that soft spot over. in the zone. Yeah, drag routes not only work against man coverage, they work against zone too. If you can find the soft spot, the quarterback gets it to him early, he can turn up field, and you saw that right there. Texas A&M ready to go with another first down. Here's the handoff. Got the first down and more. And into the end zone. Damn, I guess wrong again. Well, that's my first. Touchdown, Aggie. This is why you consistently run the Going football. To the a steady yeah, diet because you can break the long touchdown runs. Nice job breaking through the line of scrimmage. You fool me once. Shame on me. Damn, nine. You got to make that tackle. Where you going? You gave me the bad You missed that. The AT unit on the field. Hey, that's the AI. I'm, I was coming from the backside. And with the extra point, every little bit counts as they get closer. So that scoring drive took only six plays. And he finished off the drive with yeah, a 30 yard time. scoring scamper. Um, 
and he'll bring it out of the end zone. Not nearly as much as he'd hoped when he brought it out of the end zone. He'll be stopped at the 15. Jumped in the air. First down here with Man, time for maybe one more play until the two-minute warning. They go to the counter. Finds just enough daylight to work its way up to the 19-yard line. It's the two-minute warning, and we'll see if the offense can tack a little something extra on their lead before the break. And here comes the offense on second down. Here we go. Dead hunt. They're looking to get the edge with this one on the top. And a really short game before he gets a whole bunch of company from the defense. The Huskers come to the line in the hurry up. On the run, it's Rayola. Looking to the big hit. tight end. And it's incomplete on third down. Defense did a great job. Third and short on the opponent's side of the field. They're expecting quick throw. Everybody, they dug their heel on the ground. They're able to break on the ball, force the incomplete. Yeah, I'm freaking around facing the ball. I feel like he. Oh, I just got to make a better throw. I just feel like he. I feel like I could have got that. Try to jump for the ball. That is crazy. This could absolutely spin this game in another direction. They're going for it inside their own 30. On fourth down, they'll throw for it. Makes Let's go, man. The first. Turns out to be an easy conversion for this offense as they move the chains on fourth down. down. The definition of four down territory has changed over the last this few years. It's extended everything. into their own territory okay. there. Anywhere, everywhere. Just look, look at, at that card, right? That card's supposed to tell us what to do. But I wish he was faster. Was anyways, this offense took a little bit of a gamble, but they get the first down. Nothing to worry about, Reese. And the Huskers will snap it on first and ten. Looking to move it through the air. Makes the grab. It's Nair. And they pick up just a few on that completion. I love offenses and quarterbacks that are willing to take the easy stuff. Take those easy throws that are guaranteed to get positive yards. Yeah, I'm going to take big shots down the field, too. But don't forget, it's easier to pick up second and five, third and five, than it is when we start getting those long yarded situations. The give on the inside. Really nice stop there from this senior leader. And a lot of times you want those big plays. You want those splash plays. But sometimes you're going to take some losses. Good, you're not going to run the football overly well. But friendly. if you continue to run it, you can at least Twitch, create some friendly. balance. You at least have the threat of it. Otherwise, you're just going to abandon it. And now it's just going to be a passing game. On third and short, just trying to get enough for the first down. Let's go, man. And the defense finally makes the stop after the sweet run and good game. Now on first and ten from the 29. He wants to throw. A shot. Let's go, man. This shit wide open every time I run it. Let's they go. Take it in for six more points. Well, I done found the offense. No cap. This shit got to be something, boy. No cap. This package is great. Oh now, my, look at Pat Mahomes. Three receiving touchdowns on the day. All right. You see one five on the back of that jersey? How did I miss that straight down? The and he joints it off the left up right. <laughs> How I missed that? That is crazy to me. Regular accuracy, regular straight down the middle. So they got the touchdown now, going to put it in the hands of their defense to finish off this half. Hey. <laughs> From inside the 15, here's the return. Probably needed to pick up an extra block or two, but as it is, he'll be stopped at the 28. Texas A&M has it back, and we say howdy to the Aggie offense again. This late in the half, you're behind. You'd love to create something before the break to build momentum. It's complete. Hey, he's going to pick that off, dude. He's uh, after the race. Don't catch me. 
damn good touchdown. I thought that was a big. Touchdown, Texas A&M. And I tell you what, that passing touchdown, man, that should spark this whole team. Like, the comeback is more than on now. Like, they got the touchdown. They cut into the lead. You, you want to get a stop and go into the half. Get all the Chad, that's crazy. I thought for sure that was a pick. We got this. The comeback's in full effect. And the point after is good. They got the late touchdown on the board, now about to kick it away and hoping the defense can keep them from answering. It bounds through the back of the end zone. It'll be a touchback. Damn, that's crazy. And here comes the Nebraska offense back onto the field. The way this game started, you feel as if you have to score a touchdown every time you have it, and now we'll see if they can respond. Yeah, and I wonder how much pressure that puts on the offense. Jesse, like, you know this is back and forth. I gotta score, and every possession matters so much. What does that do to you as a quarterback? Well, it puts a lot more pressure on you, for sure, to feel like I gotta make every third down throw. If guys are open vertically down the field, He's I skinny. Oh. He's skinny. He's skinny. He's skinny. A huge gain on that one before he ran out. Down. Apparently some confusion as the offense calls the timeout. It's their first of the half. And in the final seconds of the first half, they'll send out the field goal unit. He'll need to unleash his thunderfoot on this 56-yard attempt from the right hatch. No, no good. Guys, still a six-point game, but a missed opportunity. And that'll bring us to the end of the first half as we head to the studio. Good half, half good half. Missing picks. Yeah. The Cornhuskers will kick it away first and will start the second half. I was thinking if I'm home, it wouldn't be shaking like that. From inside the 15, here comes the return. Able to find enough room to get it out across the 25. He's brought down at the 26. adjustments they made at halftime and, and getting the ball first here i think is such a big deal like i get the first chance to make a statement to make the adjustments to create some momentum for my squad right here in the third quarter yeah i think it's so important for this offense to set the tone here early in the second half to get a nice drive going build that confidence and, and get your defense ready to come on out get a stop and change the complexity of this game that's what you expect from a senior don't give them any extra yards great tackle there Didn't get much on first down. It's second and nine. Scanning the field. It's Wegman. And it'll be incomplete. This defense is physical and pass deep. All right. That's a good result for the defense. We knew coming into this year they wanted to really improve their pass defense and their secondary and coverage. Nice job there. Decibels rising as the crowd gets behind this defense on third down. From the gun, wants to pass. Gonna take a shot. Oh, and it slips through his fingers incomplete. That would have been a huge game if he could have held on. It's a nice job by the receiver working past the stakes. Nice. going to be a first down by the offense, but how about the no, physical fine. play knocking that ball loose? I understand the desire to keep the ball, but going for it inside your own 40? On fourth down, they'll pass for it. He'll get rid of it. The completion well past the sticks. Finally run out of bounds, but he has his offense rolling with a first down. They were willing to spin that wheel of fortune in their own territory, and it paid off. And it came up good. <laughs> I mean, I think you see the aggressiveness by these offenses now willing to go for it on their own territory, and I like it because they got it. The Aggies have their offense in high gear. They'll give it to the back. We'll give them a couple on that one. Second and eight coming up. 
That's a really good job by the defense, wrapping them up, getting them on the ground, take away that run game, make them one dimensional, put them in passing situations. Really good job by the defense. Picked up two yards on that last one. They need eight on second down. He's looking to throw. Fires to the right. I was about to pick the ball off, but you were hit stick on though. On second down, that brings up third down. Well, that looked like he was going to be about to get hit. But how about the defender making the hit and forcing the incompletion? After the second down misfire, looking at a third and eight. Wants to throw. It's Wegman. Quarterback moving. Fires on the move. A strike downfield. He will step out of bounds, but not before the big pickup and a first down for this offense. Well, how about the offense setting that play up? We've seen earlier in the game a couple shorter throws. They're just trying to suck those safeties closer to the line of scrimmage, anticipating that they would get an opportunity to take a shot. They called the perfect play at the perfect time right there. Headed to the end zone, and he's sprinting. He'll take it all the way. Touchdown, Aggie. And the offense continues to run the football. The second rushing touchdown from the running back. The offensive line paving holes will continue to feed this man the ball. And the extra point puts them on top by one. All right, check. So Bought into the lead by one. Play 75 yard drive. And the scoring play came on the 12 yard run. I believe in Nebraska. Not going to risk a return here. He'll make the fair catch. Settling for points, but sometimes when you have to settle for nothing, David, it can be demoralizing. Yeah, and it can definitely be frustrating. And I think it leads you to say maybe I go for it more. But Jesse, I think this offense just needs to put another drive together and just finish strong. Yeah, and, and be a little bit less predictable too, especially as they get closer and closer down to the end zone. He'll push his way out to the 38, pick up a three. Ball sitting right at the 30. It'll be third and short. Let's go. Here we go, Jack. Back to throw. It's Rayola. Gets it to the back. And he couldn't quite get to the marker, and that's going to bring up a fourth down. The Huskers are in the hurry up. A nice job of awareness on defense there on that third down. You know, you're expecting the offense to throw the football, but it's not just going to be receivers or tight ends you got to worry about. You got to keep your eye on where that running back is. They knew exactly where he would be, and they were able to make the tackle setting up fourth. On fourth down, trying to find his man. Come on, let's fucking go, man. Have enough for the first. Afterburner's coming. Afterburners coming. Let's go, man. This playbook got everything. Well, in the modern era of college football, you're seeing more and more athletic tight ends. Like what you just saw right there. The defense had no chance covering that guy down the field. He makes go, them look silly on his way in for the long touchdown. Go. Look at him. <laughs> what was he doing? Boy had his arm up trying to answer the question. Two point conversion attempt is on the way. He's looking to pass. Caught in the backfield. It's John. Let's go. He finds the end zone for the two, and now the lead is seven. Quick work on that scoring drive, just four plays. And they find Pater from way All right, Chad, we got the momentum back. 69 yards on the touchdown pass. The kickoff team on the field as they'll send this one away. 
Oh yeah. Fielded in the end zone. Oh yeah. And the coverage team oh, yeah. gets the turner on the ground. Texas A&M has it back, and we say howdy to the Aggie offense again. David, they love to do what they did last time and put this one in the end zone. You ain't lying. They did a great job. The offense was clicking. Everything went well. Palmer, they executed and got the touchdown. And they really were in a nice rhythm as well. And I'd love to see that here on the next drive, too. Just keep doing what you're doing. Everything seems to be working, and you seem to have this defense on their heels. After getting knocked back to open this drive, it's second and 12. They'll go to the ground. That's a 20. He's got space. Smashes him with yeah, the stick. The right He's man. run out of bounds, but not before yeah. turning in a big If I can get on the right man, player, I can just play that all the way. Well, there's the offense trying to take advantage of this running back speed. I like the call. Hand off to the left, to the outside. Put him in space and let him go to work. Keeping it on the ground with the running back. You want to make sure to maximize those types of runs, and he gets it out to the 41. You want to talk about making it easy for an offensive coordinator. You pick up a bunch of yards on first down, make that second down really, really manageable. That's a great job by the offense. On the run, it's Moss. Tackle oh, at the 45 a after a five-yard pickup. And the Aggies are moving quickly down the field. They'll ride the running back and leave it with it. Help me. <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> It looked like you were doing a re-option and he kept it. <laughs> the running back kept it. Man. 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 We'll start the quarter offense about to snap it on second down. Easy. Off the play fake. Trying to get to it. Yeah. That pass is incomplete, and they're probably fortunate that it wasn't not free for a fumble. Doesn't take this defense a lot of time to get to the quarterback, man. They've got speed all over the place. They hit him so quickly, and because of that, the ball falls incomplete. Big third down as the crowd gets behind this defense. Looking downfield, and he needs a bunch. He tries to take the top off. And this is dropped. Oh, Incomplete pass. He had a huge gain in his fingers, and he couldn't hold on. Go check. Texas A&M will have to boot it away. Second time today, they've been forced to punt. Ah! And the ball will bounce at the four and find its way into the end zone for a second. Go check. Let's put it away. Play good football, man. And here comes the Nebraska offense back onto the field. From the gun, the Gale looking for room. Not much there. Picks up a couple to the 22. At this point of the game, the offense has the lead. The offensive coordinator knows they want to keep running the football. So he's going back. He's looking at his playlist. And he's saying, which runs work the best for me in this game? What can I lean on right here to make sure we win this one? Quarterback checking the play. Toss to the outside. Just enough there to get it to the 25, a pickup of two. Damn, I should have heard about that, isn't it? So they're facing third and short from the 25. From the gun, they'll try the middle. Wow. 
really get him on the ground with a big running oh. play moves to change for the first down. And this guy really has been a workhorse today. He's made plays when his offense needed them the most. Run. He's a guy who's reliable. They know they can turn around and give him the football. And he'll go make things work out. They're going to need him to finish this game. He has to continue playing well after that big run. Now. And the Huskers with the first and ten. Defense showing plenty of pre-snap movement of their own. They'll run it. They want to take their time here. They can rely on this guy to pick up solid yardage when they need it, and he's out to the 43. And the running back there did everything that he's coached to do, right? They've got the lead late in this game. You've got to stay in bounds. You're finding turnovers hurt me last time, I'm run, But you're not going out of bounds. Really well done. The toss sweep to the right. He's knocked down, down in the back. backfield. He'll lose a couple. Really nice job by the defense getting that last stop. All third downs in games are important, but this one just feels like it's the biggest down of this game right now for this defense. If they can get off the field, they've got to give it back to their offense with as much time as possible to have a chance to win this game. To the air, it's Rayola. He took a hit as he threw it and couldn't deliver the football. It's incomplete and fourth down's coming. Oh, you know what time it is when the defense gets that stop on third down. Fist up in the air. Nice job getting to the quarterback, putting some pressure on him, hitting him, forcing the incompletion. Fourth down. Let's go, man. And they wrap him let's up, go, but not go, before. Go, he gets it up go. on the catch for the first down. You know, you always talk about the risk reward. Gambling and going for it with the lead on fourth down right there and getting Let's it, go, man. the reward could be winning the game. That was an unbelievable play. And how about this coaching staff putting their faith in their players to come up with the execution and make it happen? Trying to get the edge on the toss. If I could get outside that shit, oh, scrimmage, that'll be a loss of three. And this defense has got to make a play, right? It's the fourth quarter, we're trailing. You know this offense, they're going to get concerned and they want to eat that clock. You got to bring more guys to the line of scrimmage. Got to make plays. Got to get that football back. Damn, that's a good tackle. That dude, they could tackle. Last play was a near disaster. Already. Now dealing with second and 13. They give it to him again. One step wrap, two step squeeze. This junior knows how to get him on the ground. The Cornhuskers racing to the line in the hurry up. The receivers often will run their route based on the side adjustment. Throwing right. right. And what? they fail to hook up on third down. And that is a frustrating possession for this offense. You wanted to run the football, maybe take some That's time. That's crazy, bro. Got in a bad situation. How do you football. miss that? Stop the clock. Not how you manage a game late in the fourth quarter. I'm going for it. How do you miss that throw? Look at this chat. He's right there. Nobody contesting them or nothing. They have the lead in a one possession game, but they're thinking deliver the knockout blow. But this carries big time risk on fourth down. Linebackers trying to create some confusion. Looks as if they didn't get it off in time. It'll be a delay of game. The quarterback just lost track of the play clock. Didn't get the snap off quickly enough. I can't believe he did that shit. Almost took all my energy out, bro. Like... I don't understand. They'll it's keep the offense on the field the on fourth down already with a one possession lead. Finds him out of the backfield. He's not going to make it. And they'll turn it over on downs. And we're going to have a fight to the finish. That's it. And as a defense, that's all you can ask for. Give the ball back to your offense. Yes, you're still down. You gave them a chance. They got the football. They got some time left. Now can they put a drive together? Maybe go tie this game. Maybe go win this game. Great stop by this defense. They're going to open this drive with a pass. 
Got out of trouble, got rid of it. Pulls it in. It's green. Put it right on him. Sweet play. Good pickup, and they'll move the chains with the first down. They flexed out that tight end a little bit, and you know the tight end's always open. Always open. Quarterback's best friend, and this guy's a problem, Reese. He's a matchup problem because he's too big for DBs to cover, and he's too fast for linebackers to cover. He's showing you his athleticism there. Just missed his man, gave him just a little too much. Well, I know it hasn't been a tremendous day statistically I mean, for this quarterback, he just, but he's uh, 360 making has been good enough to there. win this game. Hasn't thrown a lot of TD so far, yeah. but when things aren't open, he throws it away like on that play right there. He's not putting his team in a bad spot, and that's why they still have a shot to walk out of here with a W. Nope. And that's going to fall to the ground incomplete. That was a physical matchup there. Third down coming. Third and long, defense knows the pass is coming, so they're going to have guys with their eyes on the QB, but they are going to try to get to him with pressure. Pinning their ears back. If you're on offense, you might be thinking blitz here. You better get rid of this one quick. Looking to throw it again. Yes, sir! Oh, Intercepted. User! Come on, Butler! Run! 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 You gotta Man, score! Now you're set you gotta score! Position, but you oh make big my plays. God! You gotta make score! Big you're turning a long way down the field. You oh, to touchdown, you gotta you score, my boy! Great scoring position. Ah! Uh, Try to reward him on defense. The reward the defender, the man. On their side as they come to the line, first and goal. They'll try to get it in with the run. He's dropped behind the line of scrimmage. That'll be a loss of three. The Huskers will hustle to the line. I can't believe that. Looking for a pass. Uh oh. To the end of the line. And he takes it in for the score. Touchdown, Corn Huskers. That is exactly what you want your offense to do. You want it to keep clock, but if you score, go up by two possessions. Nail me, Coffin. Great execution by this offense to put this game away. Put it away, man. Look at him. <laughs> yes, sir. Good. Look at Pat Mahomes, that quarterback, man. Point somebody on the way to the for the point after. And the extra point is true, and they have a two-touchdown lead, up 14 in the fourth. They got the ball in great field position, and bam, bam, two plays and into the end zone. Yeah, they do. I wasn't on the band, but... About to kick it away after scoring the touchdown. From inside the 15, chance for a good return. Break your damn head over, Chad. Enough to get it out across the 25. He's brought down at the 26. Fucking go, man. Texas A&M has it back in the offense, ready to go to we've work. We've been over an hour. After that last pick, David, they really need to take yeah, care of the ball. Yeah, we've been a longer than that. No doubt. Hey. And Palmer, I want to know what Spurrier said to you on the sideline after a pick. Hey, Do that again, and you'll be right here beside me for the rest of the game. Yeah, <laughs> you got to go out. Cool. you got to... Holds it in on the left. And he'll be marked down, but he's got enough to move the chains. Let's fucking go, man. That's how you make plays, man. I, hey, I got that pick with the defensive end, bro. <laughs> Yeah, I know. Well, they hey. used the chunk point across midfield and they've got it first and ten just outside the play play He's going to pass. Going it's back bait ball. The well, it's bait ball. Fires and it's bait. Again, oh, wow. And they'll drag him down. Get on, on we. On the interception. He looked as if he thought he had it all the way and this junior makes a play. Yeah, that Yo, your LB with it over there for the lob, and I, I mean, I just, I kind of like lean forward there when I go there. Be smart on offense. Hey, you see what Pat Mahomes throwing that bitch at? Hey, they got a Patrick Mahomes on in, in, in on, on the breast. 
He did miss a he, he did miss a couple throws for me, but salt in the wound or happy with getting the W. Yeah, and listen, this this makes the post game handshake fun sometimes. If you do to rub a little salt in it, I'm telling you, this is open every time. I'm here for it, Jesse. Like your job is to score points. It's my job to stop it. Keep the foot to the accelerator. Keep trying to play ball. I agree a thousand percent. That's like Steve Spurrier back in the day when I was playing for the Gators. You go. And the quarterback is snowed under. That was a good game, about GGs. Reach says 20 minutes. With the clock running. You trying to run NCAA Thug or you getting up? I got some trial left. They'll run it from the gun. And that is how we will wrap this one up. GGs, Vault. I know a lot of people. Play valiantly.